do some whiskey glazed salmon. Here's the ingredients you're going to need for that. You're going to need some good Irish whiskey, and these are two of the best. So grab one of these at your local store. We've got all our ingredients here. We've mixed our whiskey, our cider, and our honey in one bowl there just to get them mixed up well. We're going to put that and the rest of our ingredients into a Ziploc bag. Now, if you want to go ahead and put it in the bowl and get another bowl dirty, knock yourself out, I'm just using a Ziploc bag. We're going to marinate the salmon in that, so why not mix up all our ingredients in it as well? Okay, we got everything in there. We're going to go ahead and seal this up really tight. Make sure nothing leaks out. We're going to be shaking this up, get it nice and mixed. It's a really good marinade. This is really going to surprise you how good this really tastes on this salmon. Okay, we got that thoroughly mixed. Went ahead and cut four six ounce portions off the end of this beautiful filet of salmon we got here. This is a sockeye salmon. We're going to go ahead, you've still got the skin on them. We're going to put those in the bag to marinate. Now if you want to get in a hurry, you can leave this out on the counter at room temperature for one hour. If you're taking your time, you go ahead and put it in the refrigerator for four hours. It's your choice. It's just all based on how soon you need to cook it. Now we set our grill to 400 degrees. We're going to go ahead and put these fillets on there. We're going to close it up and we're going to leave it for 10 minutes. Then we're going to go ahead and take our marinade and we're going to brush it onto these, use it like a mop sauce, and we're going to cook them for about another 10 minutes. There you go. We're going to brush those nice, get them just as wet as you can, get as much of those seasonings and herbs and that on there as you possibly can. In another 10 minutes, these are done. If you've cooked a lot of salmon, you'll know that when you get kind of a milky white substance coming out, they're ready to go.